All right, so the goldish round, we need to kill people for setup. That's it, actually. It's that simple. I have seven kills for setup. Oh, this guy means no harm. I'm not gonna kill anybody. House is here. Didn't look like he had much. Looking naked with an SKS. I feel, I feel a little bad. I'll admit it, yeah. But any other time, I'm I'm escorting that dude through the quest and I'm helping him with it. You know what I mean? But on a hardcore account where I'm on a quest to kill players, I'm I'm taking that kill. I'm taking that kill. Any other time though, like on my main account, bro, I'm probably gonna get him to the quest, take him to the extract, and then give him my kit, right? So, like, it is what it is. And yeah, and I'm doing two quests actually, because I gotta kill people at dorms. so bad it's not ideal and the bullet travels slow god the 286 meters per second is bad what's this one two nine yeah that is bad i honestly don't know what the lore is behind the yushanka If you're talking about like why I'm running it, it's for setup. The five seven once never went back. Any other pistol? The the five seven yeah, it's really good. This is the P two two six. It's pistols are better with iron sights honestly, but I, I got this off someone else. If I take the red dot off the RMR, it's uh it becomes unusable. Since I'm solely using it to kill scavs, I was okay with it. I'm wondering if someone's in stronghold. Kind of late into the round. A little sad, more people didn't go dorms. It could just be a scav in there. It's not the worst round, not the best. We did get the one kill on the Timmy. There's still hope for some more. Wish I heard someone back here. So if I can scav. Someone inside there. There's. Nice. Did damage done to me too. 
Hell yeah. Six more kills. That's all we need. So I finish. Uh. I'm done with Punisher 6. The three trader gun build. Probably, uh. They cast them before you. I don't know who snipers have shooting at there. The AK is something for you. You can make good, make like a really good build off just the uh. Just the flea. So we don't need that either. I keep the mask. We can reset. Or we can hit the PCs and then reset. I think we do that. Uh, stat difference between the U and UN? I don't think so. But the UB, apparently there's hidden stats that will make it perform better. Uh, realistically, this wipe, I don't think it makes any difference at all. Those guns are all lasers. back for that just have to hope that old gas isn't up from the extract so that's the guy that sniper scout was shooting at and then he's fighting an old gas oh is that him Oh, he fucking killed the shotgun guy. What a troll. God damn it, dude. That's a good teammate right there, but still, fuck. Well, at least we only need five more kills. Yeah, the scab killed the shotgun guy. And this extract is up, so I gotta go back and get my bag and then come back over here. When you have the best chance. Really? Okay. PCs. True. take the ammo we aren't taking it i don't have much room and uh I'm, I'm i don't have the quest to need the sr2 for a while and then when i do i'll, I'll have ammo for it at least and the sr2 is not even that good the sight shoots low the sight's not good either i to take the armor though oops i mean jump there what you got I didn't kill this setup guy, so that was my duo, the scab. 
Yeah, the AI scab killed him. Pretty fucked up thing to do, that scab, but he's ruthless. I think that would have been maybe him. Time. You say that like it's a bad thing. You're in love with it. We got three more there. This is probably like super healthy for my brain though, having to do Tetris all the time. It's a little overkill bringing in a pistol and the AUG. Uh, AP20. AP Reason being, it has a chance to actually one tap someone. If you only got two shots, the AP20. That's why I ran around with it. Um, whenever I was rocking the shot sawed off, I used AP20. This shit was fun. How do you feel about the stash upgrade? I'm currently making the level three stash, um, but it needs another like 30 hours. How many kills do you need for setup? Five. Not very many. What's your favorite armband? There's one that you get on on woods. You have to kill 20 players without armor on, I think. It's black and red. The alpha armband is probably my favorite, actually. It's black and red, too, but I don't have that one. I can't get that one. Ah! Oh, that freed up some room. <laughs> Fuck. I shouldn't have went for the spray. I should peak tap, peak tap, peak tap. That would have been better. We barely tagged him. But it's unfortunate we lost our uh, hog. But that, not that worried about it, I suppose. Breaking out the pistol again. It almost feels good to die right now in Tarkov. I'm afraid to say that out loud. It's like alleviating a little bit of pressure. We're going to start with the flechetti spaghetti. I want to drop some fools. Suppressor on the shotgun? No. Um, the suppressor on the shotgun tanks the ergo terribly. Brings it down to like zero ergo. Without the suppressor, it's not bad ergo. Can you change the barrel length? No, I could. Um, I am on a hardcore account, so I actually can't buy anything. Um, I can barter for certain things, but uh, it's just easier to get it off an opponent. Kill that guy, dude. I thought that killed that guy. Sick. God damn it. Give me a second. There's so much going on. I ran out of ammo. I ran out of ammo. I thought I had like one or two more bullets. I thought I had more. I picked up three though. I am happy with the three. I'll, I'll take that three all day. I'm happy with that. That's good. That's a good round. We only need two more for setup. That's a big one. 
there was so much going on there. Holy shit, that was hectic for like 10 seconds in a raid. I don't have another shotgun. We need a shotgun, right? What I could do is rock a Yushanka, get the scab vest, and get get like a kit going for setup. Just rock a regular weapon, find a shotgun, pick up the last two kills we need. I think I think we do that. I think what we also do is until we get we gotta rock that we gotta rock the swag until until we get uh. A shotgun. We don't put the Yushanka on. I was gonna say we should rock one of the one of or the M4s because I can have the sixty rounders. This will be fine though. Yeah, that's a pretty good build. I'm surprised when I first peeked around the corner and and tapped that first guy a bunch, he didn't die on the first go around. And then his teammate was not prepped to help him at all. I, I would love to know the communication that was going on in that team. Yeah, bull. I. I legitimately think people would have more fun on a hardcore server than they would playing the regular game. Um, you'd have to adjust the spawn rate of some items or adjust like some of the barter stuff, but taking away the flea market and the secure container, I think would, would be a lot of fun. The secure container, I would be a little if you're on just solely because uh, cheaters. You know, the second you find that item, that, I mean, realistically, if you can't flea market it, it only goes for vendor value, then that's what it is. But it legitimately is so much fun. But like the thing that keeps a lot of people from playing hardcore besides, you know, not having, besides having to like have a second account, that's the biggest thing really. Uh, it's the other people on the server aren't uh, on a hardcore account. But if everyone was on a hardcore account, dude, it'd be so much fun. I would need to kill a scav or a no boss, a pack of boss, a scav or a PMC to get a shotgun, and then we can finish out setup. We need two more kills for setup. I never went on any like the raids or anything like that. That looked like a shotgun. I think it's a good shotgun though. It's one through three. That looks like a better one. Now we're cooking. I'm ditching out all the shells. I had to kill these scouts first and then I'll put the hat on. Hey, Black, appreciate you. Dude, the level 13 hype train. Holy. Your ability, yeah, hopefully it doesn't jam. Because, yeah, <laughs> this is pretty torn up. 49. Woof. Yeah, the jamming might be kind of bad. There's one.
Gigi's voice. <laughs> Oh man. Woo! That's a good looking sniper right there. What is there? I'm gonna, yeah, I have to finish the serve kit to uh, search this first. Get rid of the hat though. Oh my gosh, ditching the hat canceled this serve. Lol. Times the charm here. Goodness, dude. If I have to cancel this one more time, I'm gonna run away, hide in a bush, and then do it. My fingers are on the wrong controls. Nice shots. Nice shots. The uh, M855 there was not enough. No stopping power. His armor tanked. Need to go for the heady. Still, we got setup done. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. I was only planning on using that AK-102 for, for killing scavs. Oh, I guess I did have some M856A1 in the front part of it. Because I 2010 packed it. We got set up done though. That's that's nice. Right there. That is nice. I was gonna go to interchange and kill scavs, but it might actually be better to go to streets and get that. Done. If we're gonna go to streets, you know what we can do? Rock this stupid ass hat. You plant the shemag. We go kill scavs. Let's see what we do have to do on streets though. Get into real estate office. Which on this one, I might not even need the key because it can spawn in multiple areas. Um, gotta kill scavs at the Pinewood Hotel. Gotta go check the ambulances. Andy's eliminate cert 30 things take the car extract out got to get into 215 and then uh the marked room advice on setup um I I mean flechette off the flea market I personally find to be more effective than anything it's kind of like flechette's kind of expensive but to get setup done I think it's worth it I feel I feel like it's the most consistent ammo for for it 
and then you just have to get close to mid range and just spam fire center mass. Just tap, 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 tap. The aim punch from getting smacked with Flechette is so severe that their their screen's gonna be so blurred and shaky. They're not gonna be able to hit an accurate shot. They'll get lucky if they hit you. Um, and Piranha, if you don't have access to Flechette or, or don't want to spend the extra cash, and that's if you want to go CQB. Otherwise, I'd say uh, 50 BMG and try to, you know, you sit back and snipe with 50 BMG. Your third, if you're going to use 50 BMG, try to third-party fights. Yeah, I think my biggest tip that I could give for doing setup is just rock flechettes. I need to get a face mask because my air pale face is sticking out like a sore thumb. Got a door booted open. to worry about that you shonk anymore I don't want to mess with that scout from range no thank you can kill him with a pistol and that will count for grenadier cop the yeah, dandies isn't so bad it's just having no helmet I think that was a PMC. I shouldn't have repeated that. Sloppy. Sloppy. Shouldn't have repeated it. No helmet protection. <laughs> I thought it was an AI at the start. Yeah. Looked like he was maybe doing Shooterborn. Okay, we gotta we gotta tone it down a little bit because the uh, those previous raids, man, they got me hyped. Let's see what we need for the other one. Screws and sewing kit, okay. Should be streets would be best for that. I can get a bag off someone else. Yeah, we need five on that. I think we go for Shooterborn on streets. This isn't the worst one to do it with. We got the MP7. I would rather rock like this. There we go. Okay. MP7 is so dang so expensive. Yeah. The mags more than anything, really. Unless you can buy them from the vendor, then it's cheap. I haven't had like I've had this MP7 for a while. I just haven't had a bunch of ammo for it. There's like no recoil on the MP7. So if you're good at getting headshots, like JSP is fine. Mostly do task level up. Yeah, tasking is the best way to level up. I mean, going through and uh so this right here. So uh, question is going to be the best headshot. You get twice as much XP for headshots compared to other types of kills like, you know, stomach, leg, thorax, whatever. Um, looting, picking up items even if you don't want them and dropping it. Touching dead bodies. You know, just tap, tap an F on it and then tapping out of it immediately. Um, and then survival gives you a 30% bonus modifier. So all those things add up. But questing is going to be the best. And then once you get to 46, do dailies and weeklies. 46... Uh, your date from 45 to 46 your dailies and weeklies like 10 times in xp and reward here we go we're gonna tone it back a little bit this running around and doing setup and slaying out it had just up the confidence had me playing a little bit 
too aggressive, like peaking long range against uh, someone across the street with a red dot. Not necessarily the best. If they're in there, they're looting because they're taking a while to come out of there. I need to go in that building myself. Also need to get um, the beanie and the glasses. I didn't bring in the glasses. But to be able to do dandies, I have to be wearing both of those things. I should run heaven. Yeah. And uh, a few other quests on this map. I wanted to run the MP7 and I figured why not? I can run this bolt too. Trying to free up a little bit of space in the stash using stuff that I've had for a while. I killed their friend and he's like, yo, it's a cheater. I see him right there. Am I tripping? I didn't bring any backup ammo for the bolt. Fuck, dude, I'm terrible. Uh-huh. Enough to get Shooterborn done. What's crazy is these guys were probably in REA. As soon as I stopped looking, they came out. Uh, this makes so much more sense. The R the SR2, that gun, it's just, I don't like it. That makes a lot more sense though, for real. Like, the SR2 is, it jumps around a lot. I am not a fan of the gun. I'll take the ammo in case I, like, in the future, I'm going to need to use the gun too. This is a quest that asks you to do so, but... I wish I had a different ammo besides this. Maybe we just take that off and do that. One of those times this blockade didn't render.
I need to stop wasting APS hex ammo on. Jesus Christ, dude. I don't think the sign rendered for him. I should have ran over to the other hardcover. Head eyes to me. I, I don't think that uh, sign rendered. Now we know. Because whenever I first shot at that guy, when I, the first guy I killed, the sign didn't render on one of the shots. I didn't have very much sniper ammo, so I didn't want to use it to kill a scav. But I should have. I should have. We're freeing up some room, though. I will say that's not too bad. It's always the scav, man. Before anyone calls me crazy on rocking that, look at this. Boom. Turns into a 1x4. I'm tempted to bring in another bolt. Ah, uh, they ran across already. Oh, no, two of them. go to uh the bsg office This guy's gazelle on. I need that for the quest. Actually, I must have lived hard. I want to say he uh, thought he killed me, so he stopped shooting. The helmet saved me. It's like maybe twice. It didn't hit my armor at all. All right, so I was wrong on that bet. They did not go to BSG's office. <laughs> they did not. So that's actually a good idea. It's a little torn up. Got extra ammo for the bolting. No, this time I actually did intend to not bring in the extra, in the extra ammo. again this is why i brought in this gun with the build i did you turn it into one slaughter how beautiful that is i think like my best course of action for all this storage I need the gazelle, right? I want the crund, but I think what I'm gonna have to do is ditch the crund and we take the gazelle. Come on. 
I don't mind it, better to be honest with you. It can be a little much sometimes after like a death where uh Sometimes it'll be I mean the scavs are sketching me out. Sometimes it'd be a bit much because like it, it's hindsight. Hey, sword ends over ties. Yeah, that's a good call actually as well. See like that right there. Like I wouldn't have taken the sword ends over my contacts. That's a good call. So like I don't mind the backseat gaming because a lot of times it can be very uh clutch. And we are chonky as fuck after the first kill. We gotta go to the crash site or damaged house. Okay, might have been a mistake to bring in, uh... That'd be fine. Might have been a mistake to bring in the bolt action too. The box is heavy. Yeah, it's an extra two kilograms, but like I'm gonna be heavy either way from 67 to 69. That's heavy. Holy fuck, dude. We're gonna, we're gonna have to go into uh, the ESG office here. Scab man. This site's ass. It's not accurate. I need to take that red dot off of uh my other gun. Sometimes food and hydration will spawn in here. What's up, Mosin? There's some food, but it'll drain my hydration all the way. Okay. I know I need to fix my arms, but... Do that after we find hydration. While running over there. Hydration. We need a little bit more. There's some more food. And some more food. I think that's Kaban. There we go. I might go fuck up Kaban.
What the fuck, dude? Oh. I was like, why is he not let me vault? My arm stam. Damn, arm stam regains very slowly if your arms are blacked out. Never realized that. Yeah, I'm gonna put my arms back on and heal up all the way. Fix them outside? Yeah, it's much better to fix them outside uh, than in that building. That building that you want to be in and out as quickly as possible, it's highly contested. And there's only one way in and one way out. Well, I guess two ways in and out, but it, it can be very covered, very easily covered from multiple angles. Uh, maybe we just reset. I do want to go push him, not gonna lie. But we have the gazelle, and that will unlock a few quests for us, which would be really nice. Just kidding. Fuck scabs, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Fuck scabs. Absolutely insane. I swear, that's the majority of my deaths on this account have been to the fucking AI one tapping me. Thorax. One bullet counted as two. Lovely. That's twice now, dude. The, to, back to back. Where the AI kills me. Well, the first time, I was behind cover, but the cover didn't render for the scab, so he just kept shooting at me. The next time, scab fucking gets through half a letter and shoots one bullet and hits me twice with it. With PS ammo, yeah. Through level five. We lost our DVL too. I wouldn't be as upset if we didn't lose the DVL. I'm going to rock this in four. There we go. Is Magic Ergo number 52? No, I'd say 40 plus is ideal, but it depends on what site you're using. If you're going to use like a um, long range site, then higher ergo is more important. If you're going to rock a red dot, you could get away with like 40 or below. Would you change about the bots? I mean, one of the biggest things probably is them being able to see through bushes. They can spot you through bushes a little too easily. They 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 used to not spot you through bushes, and then they would then they made it to where they could spot you through bushes, and they would see you like through literally like so much foliage. And then it's somewhere in between that. Like sometimes now it's like sometimes they don't see you through the bushes, and a lot of times they do. That'd be a bit one big thing that I would change. And I'd say that the AI should never headshot you on first shot unless it's one of the advanced AI. If it's the advanced AI, then they, they could be able to headshot you. And then, of course, make it to where their one bullet counts as one bullet, not one bullet counts as two or three, because that shit's annoying. And yeah, like them being able, they're like their lock on, they spot you so quickly. Like I was peeking a scab through like this like tiny ass crack and uh I, I went to shoot at him and the dude immediately turns and fucking goes to shoot me. Like their their spotting is way too insane. I like this reticle a lot. I might start using it with uh the canted sight on my main. I kinda fuck with it. Right? nice huh what's the scope uh tao t a zero wonder if bsg plays their own game bsg plays their own game so, some of them definitely do they have us so far yeah i'm sure i'm sure some of the devs do play i feel like it's been in development so long that like not everyone wants to play the same game for hours and hours and hours and hours on end and at the fps genre or you know looter shooter extraction 
might not even be the the some of the devs main like I don't know main main type of game to play Holy fuck There's a PMC down there Rip dude Tarkov is not being kind to me right now that kind of scared me. I think there was two of them because he came in naked and got his kit from his homie. Rest in peace, that cool M4. Okay, we got we got to change it up a bit. Armor has made no difference, though. I will say. I th think I rock this guy, but we change up the sight. On the butt stock, we got this guy 46. Yeah, 64 too. That's gonna be a little, that's gonna be snappy. We are freeing up some room, which I, you know, silver lining, silver lining. But that we've freed up enough room. I'm done freeing up room. No more, no more handing out kits. <laughs> okay, let's see. Streets, I was wanting to go hit the filing cabinets and get all that shit done. Alright, let's hit the filing cabinets. We need screws and we need uh What was the other item? It wasn't a kick tape. Sewing kit, it was a sewing kit. I don't think we get sewing kits out of uh the filing cabinets. This will allow us to upgrade our lab to level two, which will allow us to craft magazine cases. I'd have to look to see what else I needed for the other other upgrades. I'm really my, uh, really only concerned with the sewing kits and the screws. We could get pretty quickly. There we go. Four more screws. In parts, okay. Nice. We, we already have all that stuff, so we'll be golden there. Take some metal parts. Is that'll free up a lot of room too. That's probably one of the things taking up the most room in the stash or magazines. I need green um gunpowder too. The eagle gunpowder. Survival lighter. I have an MVD key. Felt the presence. Thought I had the butt pad on the AK. You're not getting mad at rats. I mean, it's not. 
There's nothing wrong with ratting in Tarkov. It's a stealth game. They probably weren't even ratting. They probably heard you from hella far out and uh, just set up on you. I think we need the drill. I'm not sure on that. I'm going to take it just in case. It can be frustrating to die in Tarkov like regardless, right? But I think everyone rats sooner or later. No, not, not to like... So um, Arena is a perfect example of it. I don't mean to... And then I'm not calling on anyone specific. Everyone does it. But literally the guys that I know to complain the most about ratting when we win against them in Arena Bro, they literally would run to a certain spot prone and sit and hold an angle and not move. A, a game that's specifically meant to go for PvP, all they did was go and hold angles and not move. And those were top tier players. And so to think that like in Tarkov, a game that's not all about PvP, to expect someone to yell out, yo, I'm over here, touch gloves, touch gloves. It's just silly. Every single player at one point or another has ratted a player. Guarantee it. Again, that's what I was saying. I'm not trying to call it any, any specific player because it was literally anyone. And we did it too, right? That's that. But a game that specifically meant to PvP, it, it came down to like holding angles and waiting. Ratting. You know what I mean? But then you have Tarkov, which it's not all about PvP. PvP's, you know, like the fourth thing down. You can't expect people to not do it. We need that DVD player. What bar is the DVD for? It's for a hideout upgrade. I'll take that roller. I don't really need cash anymore. We used the cash to upgrade, so we're pretty golden there. I'll take the stims, though. Finance key that was. I'm okay with not fighting anyone this round. I just want to get a dub in after getting my ass killed by scabs. I don't really need diaries at all. I think I've, I guess I do need to sell a little bit to Peacekeeper, but I can also just buy dollars. Okay, we got to go to REA. We can check the ambulances. We got to take the car out. That's pretty much it. Yeah. We'll check REA. Like a random kit builder. There's a website that'll do that. I'm gonna go in there. With the final comments. What's wrong with it? It just doesn't pin like it should. The, the really good ammo for it. It's the best ammo in the game and it should be one tapping chest through any armor and it doesn't Level three armor blocks it It's done it all wipe I don't, I don't think BSG knows how to fix it What ammo the AP We're looking for screws and a sewing kit and then I have lab level two upgraded. 
I'd like to get lab two upgraded tonight. I also need caps and wires. It only takes three hours to upgrade it, so I would like to start it tonight. Lab's card. Speak of the devil. Yeah, I summoned the lab's card. Yeah. <laughs> Ask about a red card. If I find a red card, would I go to labs? Best way to get tank battery? Lighthouse. Oops. Lighthouse and hit the technical crates. shelf on the left in the room up top okay we'll see we'll see terror group security armory key pretty sure i need that for a quest too no the pack of lost trick doesn't work for gluhar The one on the wall is the REA key, but I'm looking for screws. I just need a few more to upgrade my hideout to lab level two. This is security one crush and blue Oh yeah, it's like the, there's one key over there that we need. I think I, it might be for an event quest actually. All right, where I found it last time was right there. Damn. Is that green battery? Noise. We'll take that all day. I'm gonna go downstairs and look first. Okay, not there. There it is. Boom. Good thing I didn't waste my time. <laughs> I think I already cleared all the tables and everything. Let's take a peek and see if the car's up. We finished that quest too. Alright. We got crash site and collapse crane. We can hit up Lexos for the filing cabinets and then we'll go collapse crane for crash site actually. I think Caban's up. I dropped my freaking grenade back there, dude. He's trying to aim bomb me through that. What a bitch. Okay, we're gonna drop. There it is. One nade in dream. That's all I need. I don't need more than one nade. The one nade so, so I can get in. Hopefully the uh, guy doesn't aim bomb me through the wall. He might.
guess the gazelle we need. Beautiful. Nico Caban for the quest line. Bosses guards down. Grab nades. Uh, I shouldn't need nades. Maybe against Kaban in the uh, garage, I will, but we'll be fine. I guess I could search him for nades right now. I don't have to worry about coming back to him for it. He's over in a spot that I haven't fought him at in a long time. Is there a guy for killing Kaban? Say it wouldn't let me swap my shoulder. I have one, but it's a little outdated because they now um, don't let you jump in on the sides. And so you just need to throw a nade to go in the front. Probably should do another one. Just update it. I'm already using a wall bang me here. You think that's funny, bitch? Where is this fat bastard? The PKP too, PKM fuck. That's a good ammo though, hopefully. I guess any of his ammo wouldn't be bad on this account. Not a lot of time left. I wonder if his guards spawned and they're like running into that vehicle over there. We did get the gazelle, which is huge.
Вон он! Вон он! He's got BS ammo. Not bad. T46 ammo. It's not the best, but at least it's some ammo. <clears throat> Dude, if I get fucking one tap by a scab on the way out, I will lose my shit. We have collapsed crane. We, we're really close. I probably didn't need to uh, worry about it. We could have we looted a little more. Ambulance. Yeah, true. It would be good to check the ambulances. It's okay. Five minutes. I'm not too worried about the ambulance quest. I'm going to scan this entire fucking area. I need to be more careful with the uh, AI and check like all the corners. I'm being too lenient with it. It's frustrating to dine to the AI with like getting one tapped and stuff, but honestly, most of my AI deaths have been because I've given them too much uh, leeway. If I treated him like a PMC, then I don't think I would have died to him. MOE, MOE good on the belly? It's alright. The MOA is more like ammo and gun dependent. I don't think scopes have any MOA. But like with this gun, it's alright. 76239 is not really like a great long range gun, but it's okay. This has already been looted, but hopefully we can get fucking my man. We also could use that paracord. I was literally about to say, let's see if we can pull some screws. Need the material crafter case. Um, we need one more screw. And then the sewing kit. One screw and a sewing kit. The sewing kit we can easily pull on a different map. If we could pull a screw here, that would be huge. I'd be very, very happy with that. We we have clap screen. We have the, we're at our extract. Got the gazelle that's huge that's a good one see that that reset is what we needed right there level 38 now let's go big win there i'm i'm very satisfied with that round big dude opens up quite a few quests for us I could have grabbed that 6P13 too. The 6P13 is easy to find though. Got the rest in. Go upgrade rest space. I appreciate you, brother. I hope Rimworld's uh, going well. There we go. We just need three more or four more guys up to max, which he we need, we need to do a little bit of quest for him. We need a little bit more through him too and money spent, but we're not even 42, so. We can do this one. It's a lot of XP. Holy shit. Marking three things on woods. I think we do interchange. Let's get it. <laughs> 